nice forged hook. it up again. Went to a square, <clears throat> an octagon, by taking the diamonds off, and then around. All right, take it just over the edge and start sweeping motions down. I'm putting a curl on this. You can hit it up against the back, like that, come down, however you want to do it. It's nothing special. I just don't want it to catch on anything. So let's heat it back up. I think I'm going to do this one a little differently. Curl off, cool off the curl. It's cone mandrel. And then make a fairly tight bend around that. Yeah, that's pretty good. Just got to be able to hook that chain on. Need a little smaller than that. to be a little bit more over curled so that when the chain hooks onto it it'll uh it will uh have a tendency to stay on more my old cut off in there it's not even a fancy one it's just one I welded together real quick just pick a spot worry about the end there it's ragged because I'm gonna put weld on it so Let's cool it off never leave those in the anvil don't need my hammer or oh, I may hang on the I don't know if I need the tongs or not now let's get ready to weld that on we'll be done I don't know if I take it all apart and paint it, but yeah, I think I will use my tongs just to hold it in place. And that'll work. 
just roll it out of the way. Turn off the valve. Turn off the welder. Thank you for, sorry about the lights in your eyes there. Uh, yeah, well, I can't help it. <laughs> but anyway, thanks for uh, checking in. Have a blessed day. We'll talk to you later. Bye-bye.